Hello everyone, so I'm here in uh, Roszla in uh, Poland where I was visiting uh, for the, this event, uh, Futurix Day. That's uh, the first uh, one large event that we're going to do across the world. And uh, very, very uh, interesting, very nice. First of all, we have all these nice demos, you know, that are really uh, forward-looking, very uh, future-oriented. And uh, I, I must say I love each of them. And uh, I found also in the discussions with the teams here a lot of uh, energy and uh, enthusiasm. I mean, I would say that uh, Rochla, I've not been to the other sites yet uh, in Poland, but Rochla has become a futuristic site with a lot of uh, new ways of working, new ways of thinking. You know, people are very uh, uh, open to trying new things, uh, testing new ways of developing software, of uh, joining communities, of, uh, and we discuss things like uh, uh, data democracy, we discuss things like uh, the new uh, tools that the Bell Apps would bring to us, like the Noodle search engine and so forth, and uh, every time this, this was a great uh, discussion. This is a uh, four carrier carrier aggregation technology plus a four by four MIMO. And uh, thanks to that, we are able to achieve 1.2 gigabits uh, of throughput uh, over, the, over the air. Hi, my name is Mirosov Berg. I'm working here on the IHAC uh, team. We are prototyping digital design for the 5G. And what you can see here, it's a modem of wireless backhaul communication. The modem was made for the Mobile World Congress and what we have here, here is only a digital part of it because we are the di digital team and that's what we want to take it. Today we are showing a demo system of the 5G BTS, so a pre-commercial product that has been done together with the Bell Labs team and it's showing our capabilities on the central frequency of 28 GHz and showcasing an 8x8 MIMO system on 200 MHz carriers. Today in the demo we are showing the end-to-end -end, uh, architecture including the 5G air interface, edge cloud and the SDN core network. The goal of this demo is to demonstrate the impact of the network latency on the new use case which is the industrial automation. This opens up new market opportunities. I'm very positive and uh... I left um, the, the discussions asking uh, our teams to really take us forward and uh, help us transform uh, Nokia and the, the way um, we create innovation and technology. So overall, a very, very uh, positive experience.